it is supernatural word for the day. Just a lifting time. I just love the word of God. Now today is Thursday. The 10th of June 2021. And the greatest apostle, Apostle Amos, has a very special message for you and for me. With a theme, not of this world. Just say, not of this world. And the theme scripture is got from the book of John chapter 17 and verse 16. The Bible says, they are not of this world. Even us are not of the world. And the apostle continues to give us the word. That has it ever crossed your mind that we are only strangers here on earth? It is a question. Yes! In Christ our dwelling is Zion. Just say we dwell in Zion. The mountain of God. We are not of this world anymore. Because we have been translated into the kingdom of God's dear son. Jesus Christ. Now, while here on earth, for a time being, we should live as pilgrims. You should therefore not conform to the standards of this world. The renewing of your mind with God's word should transform you. As advised by Paul in Romans chapter 12 and verses 2. Romans chapter 12 and verses 2. We are advised to renew our mind. Now that we are strangers on earth, we are no more subject to the laws of this present age. Just say, I'm not subject to the laws of this present age. You should have this consciousness always as a child of God. And remember that we are only here to be a blessing to the world as we wait for the return of the king the lord jesus himself we are a blessing to this world we are a fragrance of christ among those who are being saved and those who are perishing that is according to second corinthians chapter 2 and verses 15 and a man of god apostle Amos, continues to enlighten us through the word of god the light to think talk and act as one that belongs to the city of the living God. Your culture and man of life are and should be shaped by the word of God. There is no way you're going to get yourself acquainted with your new life except by giving yourself to the word of God. Just give yourself to the word of God. Because the word of God is the only reality on this side of heaven. Hallelujah. The meditation scriptures, the first one is God from the book of Hebrews, chapter 12, and verses 22. The Bible says, But you've come to Mount Zion, and to the city of the living God, the heavenly Jerusalem, and to the innumerable company of angels. And John chapter 18 and verse 36, Jesus answered and said, My kingdom is not of this world, if my kingdom were of this world, my servants would fight so that I should not be delivered to the Jews. But now, my kingdom is not from here. Just tell someone that I'm not of this world. Hallelujah. The one year Bible study plan, we have 2 Samuel chapter 19 and 20 and John chapter 10. Let's rise up and we we'll make this prophetic declaration together. Just get ready and say, Dear Father, Thank you for making me a partaker of the inheritance of the saints in the light. You have translated me into the kingdom of your dear son, Jesus Christ. I declare that I'm not of this world. I am from above. I am born of God. I dwell in Zion, 
the mountain of God just speak in other tongues in the name of Jesus I am not of this world I dwell in Zion oh sakipro nikezoli pradi lero sekila lo sakredia for as Jesus is so I am in this world oh sakironosa ile gora to pranise litokure ni soria ile zorile ralo kure le sali rato kure le pradia Oh zoli ki prado seli rado sonde le pradi le kokato zoli rado sele 